how to create automatic birthday campaigns with a MailChimp. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how simple it is to create customized uh, birthday campaigns within your MailChimp account. It is very easy and very simple. All you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to head over to MailChimp.com. Then you are going to need the account or create an account within the platform. After that, you are simply going to create the campaign. But before that, you are going to add the contacts because here the contacts are the most important thing here in this uh, specific tutorial. So go ahead and click on add contacts. You can import the contacts from a list, for example, here or a file can also copy and paste them like that. We have three methods, copy and paste, upload as a CSV file or a tab delimited text file. Also, we have the choice to import from another service, or you can go ahead and add the contact manual like that by adding a single contact. Uh, the only thing it required here is to put the email address. So go ahead and put here the email address. So we are going to Put here first name, last name, address, city. Uh, these are not very necessary, but it is um, good to let them here on this specific area to get the all the information that you need for the uh, behavior, for example, or the geographic behavior of that specific individual. After we have created the specific contacts and also imported all the contacts, we need to create an automation. How we can do that? We are going to click on the button which has the magic pin right here. We are going to click on it. Then we are going to create an automation. So we're going to click on create journey. So right here, we are going to choose from a pre-built journey. Maybe we'll see here the uh, birthday of the customers, also the subscribers to make a notification for their birthday with an email. So right here we have all the templates. We need only to uh, see here the most convenient one for us. So here we have the channels. We are going to choose only the emails. For the topics, we are going to click on it and then we are going to filter. So here we have events, special dates. So we are going only to select the special dates. Because for the audience management, we are going to see here the segmentation, e-commerce, we are going to see only the templates that has or contain some e-commerce uh, topics, feedback, general, we are going to select special date. So right here, we have the nurture leads. The first one, which is the most popular one, we have celebrate customer birthday. We have mother days, sign up anniversary, remind contacts about appointments or reservation, celebrate annual emails or events. We are going to select the birth date. So here we are going to see, uh, you will need here the contacts are added when the contact is added a set time before their birthday, a paid MailChimp plan, of course, an audience, a birthday audience field, and also the journey objective is to sell stuff. So this journey will send one email on a customer birthday, tag customers who received a birthday offer. So you can see here all the plan, all the automation that we have here. We have the first thing contact is added at a set time before their birthday, send one email or an email offer or birthday email at tag received a birthday offer. So we're going to see here, these, this is an automation and also a trigger. This is an action and this is an action. So we are going to click on the action. We are going to use this journey. Click on continue. Now we are going to wait. And here we have the journey automation set. So we are not going to uh, here do something like upgrading, but it is very necessary for you to upgrade. So this is not a free uh, part here we have the shoes date you are going to put here the, the field date you are going to put here uh, much as a 90 date here we have the um, this is for the customers you are going to put it here you are going to create an email 
to and from to their email address from here uh, from us jack smith the subject what do you want for your birthday this year the schedule as every day as soon as possible and the tracking to enable google analytics link tracking so here we have the template we are going to click on the template to select it and then we are going to see here the number of templates so as you can see right here we have all of the uh, templates available we can go ahead and um, uh, filter them by the style the email purpose for example here uh, we have seasonal thank you you have also the industry you can select the industry and etc but since here we have the uh, email of uh, a birthday we are going to see here if we have a birthday email or we can go ahead and customize one free template by ourselves for example this one i'm going to select it and click on apply so here we are going to put the logo now here the email or this text block i'm going to put here happy happy birthday and for the nomination or the name of the customer you're going to add a custom field right here or a parenthesis containing the name of the specific uh, sender it will be added automatically within the um, email campaign from the recipients now go ahead and modify all these and uh, also you are going to add a specific image go ahead and add a or browse an image from here uh products or canva for example you can go ahead and add whatever image but in the in this case you are going to add it in the concept of birthday so you are going to add a cake add some layers add some uh, stickers the uh, partying stickers also a lot of things so this is the first thing now we have the um your uh, the choice to add a divider go ahead and add for example a coupon or add a product here you can go ahead and add a product then don't forget the description we wish you for example we hope that for example you will get or you will reach all of your goals for example this is a motivating message then you are going to add the product go ahead and add a product select the store if you have a, a shopify store go ahead and select any of the products then you are going to add the uh, for example a custom code or you can create a promotional code for this a specific email for all of the birthdays uh, boys or, or girls then you are going to save and return to the journey after that the journey will set up automatically everything and then you are going to click on continue send or set this to the particular uh, birthday dates that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content. I hope to see you soon on the next one.